Nashville is the Hollywood for country music now. Branson's the Las Vegas for country music. Here in the Bristol region, we, we're the Williamsburg. We keep it pure, we keep it that way. And these musicians weren't drawn here as a magnet, they were here, they've always been here. fellow in the team model, which is my dad, that's the log house I was born in, out on Parson Creek. One of the first places I ever heard about here was Gene Boyd's Barbershop. You have a lot of the older folks that come in there and continue to keep this music alive. Everywhere I go, musicians show up. Well, see, I barbered in the Navy. And the reason I become a barber, they caught me drunk one day. I got some of that old bark quarter to that stuff. Yeah, I drank that stuff and laid down on my bunk and went to sleep. Somebody kicked me on the leg and said, Hey, sailor, what are you doing laying on your bunk? I said, Oh, it's my day off. He said, What do you do? I couldn't think of nothing but being a barber. I'd been over to the barber shop and there wasn't nobody in here. He told the O.D. fellow following him around making notes all this, if you take Mr. Boyd over to the barber shop, I'll be aware for a haircut. That was my first haircut. They call this the barber shop bunch out here. And uh, we just play with Tom, Dick, and Harry here. Whoever comes in, welcome. To play. I come in and started coming in here in about 70. In 1927, Ralph Peer came to Bristol. Railroad town, railroad came through here, good gathering point, and uh, Pop knew, since he was from Galax, this would be a good hotbed to come and find the southern music of the time. Jimmy Rogers came over from Asheville, North Carolina. The Carter family became the first superstars of country music. I've heard a lot of folks say it's a shame that Bristol didn't turn into Nashville. We missed the boat. I don't think we missed the boat. I think it gives us an opportunity now. Nashville's not filling that void with roots music. These musicians weren't drawn here as a magnet. They were here. They've always been here. And everything that I can see, they're always going to be. It's, it's, it's part of us. <laughs>